Hi, this is Lian Eng from Go Parents. Today, I'm going to talk to you about the benefits of part-time work for your teenagers. If you have teenagers that are working on a part-time basis, let's celebrate. It's great for them. I'm just going to list out a couple of benefits, how you could actually acknowledge the benefits that they will gain from the part-time work. For example, your high school child, if they are working on a part-time basis, these are the following things that they can learn. It's the discipline. The first thing is discipline, that turning up to work on time. This is great. It's just like everything has to have discipline, turning up to work on time. It takes a lot of discipline to do that, especially for teenagers. Secondly, while in the workforce, you learn to take instruction. You learn to listen to instruction and apply it in the workforce. This is very valuable skills. The third is um, conflict resolution. How are you going to resolve an issues uh, between yourself and a customer or between yourself and a co-worker or within the organization at the same time? So this is a very valuable skill to learn. Number four is time management. How are they going to manage their time between work and their schoolwork, after school commitment and their social life? It's very valuable skills. Number five is they, need, they learn to be, to be appreciative of what they earned and being financially independent, finally able to get or buy anything that they want without having to ask for money. All they earn is through their own hard work. And number six, how to liaise with customers. This is very valuable. Get customer skills, and this is how communication flows. And this is a skill they will carry on to even apply to life skills. You know, how to communicate with siblings, friends, parents, relatives. And what about university students? This is a little bit more um, job oriented or course specific. So for, for all the above I've mentioned, on top of that, if a university student, by the time they work, they will probably be in more of a supervisory level. So this is what they will learn. Um, for example, uh, leadership opportunity, what uh, the students may be working at supervisors, um, uh, working directly with the management team. And um, secondly, um, being re, re, how to relate what they learned to the costs that they're studying. Um, for example, if you are an accounting student, how do you apply? How do they account for the cash flow? How do they account for all their uh, um, revenues, expenses, things like that? Those are learned uh, and applied uh, skills where they learn from uni and apply it in the workforce. Learn the different technologies. What are the accounting software they're using? What are the technologies they're using? And communication. On top of uh, com basic com com uh, communication, this will be communicating on a professional level. How do you take your ideas? How do you apply your ideas onto management? And on top of that is the, the confidence that you're able to see what you're studying and apply to actual workforce. So I hope you benefit from this segment.